Kia ora Fano. It's your favourite time of the week where we get to announce last week's winners uh, that win a month supply of delicious Pix peanut butter for their efforts during Kaitiaki Tanga Week. Once again, so many incredible videos. We had kids, uh, students singing Waiata, performing Haka, um, talking about how they were going to be Kaitiaki of their environment and their locality. So keep up the awesome work. So we've got five winners, uh, this from, from last week, and those winners are, drum roll please, Judith's Ko-Fi class at Upper Atamuri School, Caroline's Pahutakawa class from Farm Cove Intermediate, we have Annie's Rangatahi class from Aranui School, well done. We have Sarah's Room 14 class at Cockle Bay School. And we had an awesome time, uh, myself and the Sports Squad crew, visiting Cockle Bay School on Monday. Um, we're going to send um, a couple of jars to uh, Annie Willis's homeschool um, students. We've loved getting your videos from Bali, it looks like at the moment. It looks like you're having a great time over there. You'll need to send us a New Zealand address though, for the pics. Uh, and the final class for last week's winners for a month's supply of pics peanut butter go to Vanessa's Te Kodu class at Papa Rore School. Um, and that class did an entire play, a 15 minute play in their school assembly uh, that covered the entire Squawk Squad program and we were absolutely blown away uh, with the awesome work that you guys were doing. And um, keep trying uh, to get that Kiwi to fly, you're almost there. Uh, so we hope you're having a ball with Conservation Week. Um, it's not too late to get other classrooms involved in your school. Um, so keep up the amazing mahi and we'll check in with you um, after the highlights. Enjoy! Oh, Squawk Squad! Hey Squawk Squad! There was a tiny fawn named Awarua who lived in Te Awarua or Porirua. Now, if you look at Fitirea, you can see the spot where Awarua the tiny fawn crashed. Tihe e mori ora, kia ora koutou. Ko taranaki te maunga, ko e toki te awa. Ko hatu pā taku kura, ko te ati awa te iwi, ko aumai te onai. Ko nga te rahiri te hapu, ko tukamaru te waka. Ko Kim oku whaia, ko Matthew oku matua, ko Paxton tuku ingoa, Ko Cleaver to Kufano. Tina Koto, Tina Koto, Tina Tato Kato. Let's go find some plastic. Plastic. Clean up the environment. Like what eels and that because they don't need it. So today we've just been flying around all the around our native Cody tree. Kaitiaki Tanga means looking after things like caring for the environment. Kaitiaki is guardianship or leadership of something. For us, it means like leading for our school because we've got student kaitiaki. And, and we, we will be talking about what kaitiaki and kaitiaki tanga means to us. Kaitiaki to me means being the guardian of other people. Hello, we've been learning about kaitiaki tanga. What does that mean? Uh, we have been, uh, uh, it means um, caring about um, our ocean. We're going to have the hands of our school. We're taking our school and we clean the bottles. And what do you clean the yogurt bottles for? We, so we can make stuff out of them. I pledge to become a kaitiaki in my school for some more native birds and less rubbish. This is our cup of 
to our assemblies. In these past seven weeks we have been part of a program called Squawk Squad that is dedicated to saving the native birds in Kaitiaki Tango New Zealand. <laughs> In Māori, we learnt about Kaitiakitanga. And welcome to Pahutakawa Live. We are going to interview a few members from Pahutakawa. We have gone to the Waitaki Rangers, planted trees, gone, to, gone around the school and cleaned up, and we've also made pest traps. <laughs> Culture and the environment. Hey, 